Well, hello, Highland Park. I am sitting in one of the favorite places in my life. That's the sanctuary of Highland Park United Methodist Church. And I can't tell you how much I miss hosting worship with you physically located right here in these pews. So I want to give you an update and let you know that we are working diligently to create a time in early August where we can all be back in here together. Now, let me tell you about why early August. We want three things. We want you to be safe, we want you to feel safe, and we want the experience to be meaningful. And if we were to open the doors of the church today, we'd only be permitted to have about 130 people in this sanctuary. Everybody would be in masks, we would not be able to sing, and the experience would be substandard. In addition, we wanna make sure that you are safe and that you feel safe. So we are not date-driven, we're gonna be data-driven and we're getting closer and closer to being back in this building. Now, having said all of that, let me tell you what we are going to do and I couldn't be more excited about this. On July the 5th, Sunday, July the 5th, to cap off July the 4th weekend, we will host a large in-person worship service. We're gonna do it right across the street at SMU's Ford Field. That's their football stadium. And they've uh, been kind enough to give us that stadium for use on July 4th weekend. And I've extended an invitation to Highland Park Presbyterian Church. And really the first time we've ever done this. We're gonna to come together, two churches, one community for a great expression of public worship on July the 5th. Now we have all the room that you could possibly need to be safe in the stadium. We're going to have wonderful music and I cannot wait to see each and every one of you. Now in the meantime, we have many, many ways for you to stay connected with what's going on here at the church. Let me just tell you about a couple. VBS, one of the biggest, most important programs that we run every summer for your children. We will have VBS virtually beginning June the 1st. So you can go online to hpumc.org slash VBS and get all of your materials. Our children's ministry team has been working so hard to create a really innovative, creative, and meaningful VBS program for you and for your family. Also, this Sunday, this Sunday, we have drive-through Sunday. Now, what that means is our parking lot will be open from 1 o'clock to 4 o'clock. And we're inviting all of our church to drive up here around the boulevard at SMU and in through the church parking lot. And you'll have an opportunity to drop off essential items that so many of our nonprofit partners need to help the city of Dallas. You can go online and find out that list of essential items. But more importantly, really, when you get up here, we'll have an opportunity to sit and visit with you just for a few minutes. I can't wait to see you. You've been looking at me online for over 12 weeks and I've been able to see you at all. So this Sunday, we're gonna break the ice and get back in physical proximity where I can say hello to you and I can't wait for that as well. Then the last thing is this, we're launching a brand new Bible reading plan about the book of Acts. And we have said from the beginning of this pandemic that the church is not a building, it's a movement. And if ever that were true, it's in the book of Acts. That's the first expression of Christianity as a congregation. It's what happened immediately after the resurrection. So I'm gonna invite all of you to join me as we read through the book of Acts and talk about what it truly means to be a church. I miss you all like crazy. I can't wait to see you in person. And in the meantime, you're in my prayers and I hope to see you very, very soon.